I feel like Adam State, if it wouldn't have been for Adam State, if I would have been at a, a bigger college where they didn't really care what I did after I graduated, then I wouldn't be prepared to move on and I'd probably just be getting a job and living the rest of my life doing that job. But instead, I actually want to, I want to continue with my education and I want to continue bettering myself, I guess. My project was an ethnographic study of families and their children in public environments. So what I did was I went to a local swimming pool and spent approximately 12 hours watching families um, and seeing how they interacted with each other. And I looked specifically at different types of families, so I looked at different demographic backgrounds. I looked at race, I looked at um, gender of the parents, and I also looked at socioeconomic status. And what I found was that there's different ways that these different sorts of families spend their family time. So I, like for example, I found that higher status Caucasian families, they more force the family time, like make their children stay there, make them talk to them, whereas lower economic status white families will kind of want their kids to go away, leave them alone. Whereas Hispanics, the, the family time isn't forced. So they their children just know what's expected of them. They all stay together and it's very like a big family unit. So just like seeing how different families organize themselves, I think is really important to see how different families can be and how unique each family can be. You know, she spent the hours in the field observing, taking extensive notes, uh, going back at ho to home at night and, you know, filling all those notes in. So she had just really rich field notes. That's what was really good. You go in with uh, sort of this inductive approach in which you're just looking to see what, you know, what, what can I draw out of this? You know, what do I see going on in these interactions? And so she was able to really draw out some very interesting findings. And so um, then she, you know, began writing the drafts of it, and I got to kind of participate in that and make suggestions for how it could maybe be a little bit more detailed or a little bit clearer. So it's been, it's been a really great project to, to work with Ashley on. The professors and the other students, they took an interest in who I was, what I liked to do. So I just always have felt really included. I guess in a way I just feel like I'm noticed. I don't feel like I'm ignored or passed over. I feel like everybody here legitimately cares about what I'm doing and why I'm doing it and where I want to go. So that's ultimately why I chose and why I stayed. Mm -hmm.